Hello everyone, welcome to Harsha Lectures. In this lecture, I am going to explain you about maximum nest nesting depth of the parenthesis. So here, a string is a valid parenthesis string if it meets one of the following. So here, what they what they mentioned is we need to find out maximum nesting depth of the parenthesis. For example, here in this example one, they given here one here they given this input. So here eight is having three open parenthesis and three closed parenthesis. So the number of maximum parenthesis is available for this eight only. So we need to show the output three parenthesis are the highest. Here the explanation is digit eight is inside of three nested parenthesis in the string. So we need to find out the maximum nested parenthesis which is having in that string. Okay, and here in this example two also for this we are having three parenthesis, three nested parenthesis. So here the count is also output is also three. So in this way we need to show the output. Okay. So for this question, I, I will implement one logic. First, I am mentioning int result variable equal to zero and current equal to zero. I, cre I created two variables and for the two variables, I allocated the value with zero. And here I will mention for int i equal to zero and i less than s dot length and i increment okay in this i will mention if s dot character at of i if it is equal to open parenthesis then i will mention here result equal to math dot max and in this i will mention result comma pre increment current and here also i will make pre increment i okay and here if s dot character at of i is equal to close parenthesis then here i will mention result equal not result here i will mention current decrement so here i will return result so this is the logic so we'll check whether this will be execute or not yeah accepted so i will explain clearly once again i just created two variables one is result and current i just allocated zero value for those two variables and here in this for loop i just uh, mention i equal to zero and here I just iterate the first position to last position in the given string. In that given string, I start comparing with s dot character at i position. What is happening from first position to last position? I will check if that every element is equal to parenthesis, open parenthesis or not. If that having, if it is find out the open parenthesis, then I am storing in the result. And again, I just to find out the maximum number of nested parenthesis, I mention math dot max. So with the help of this logic, I am going to find out maximum number of nested parentheses so by implementing in this this logic we can able to find out the output so this is the logic behind it now i will submit this code yeah success so what i am saying is if you have any queries you can mention your doubts in commentary session and please do like and subscribe for more videos thank you